We've all been there. You're away on an amazing holiday and suddenly you realize you're missing something that would have made things a lot easier. As a content creator that has been traveling for over a decade, I've had a countless number of these experiences and I don't want them to happen to you. So in this video, I'm gonna cover eight of the best travel gadgets and gear that you need for your next trip to make it so much easier. And trust me, you're gonna to wanna to stick around because number six, seven, and eight have been my favorite by far. All right, so the first gadget that you're going to need is a good travel wallet. It's something that can hold all of your important documents such as your passports, visas, as well as your key currency cards and currencies of the country that you're gonna be traveling to. Chances are that your current wallet or clutch may not have enough space for this, so you can store all of these items in one place. Alternatively, if you don't wanna carry your travel wallet around with you all day, you may just want a smart wallet. These are wallets that have RFID protection while also providing quick access so that you're not rummaging through your bag while you're out and about. Number two, this one's simple, but I really recommend having a combination lock or multiple handy. There are often times where the accommodation you're staying at may provide a locker or you may rent one and they don't always provide their own locks or often they have a fee for doing so. That way, by having your own combination lock, you're familiar with the code, you can use it for either your luggage or for any lockers that you might use. Number three is wired power, specifically that matches the destinations and the countries you're going to be going to. For this, I recommend getting a universal adapter and pairing it with a multi-port charger because you're probably gonna have multiple electronic devices with you and your power point from home may not work in the country that you're traveling to. So investing in one really good universal adapter that can change according to whichever country you're in, as well as a multi-port charger that can can charge your camera, your smartphone, and anything else that you've got is gonna be an absolute game changer for you. Next up, portable power. Whether you're gonna be in transit, doing hikes, or overnight treks, you won't always have access to a power point. So making sure you have a power bank or a smartphone-specific battery pack is gonna be really handy. As an iPhone user, I love having the MagSafe battery because it attaches to the back of my iPhone without needing extra cables. But choose whatever works for you and your devices. Next up, a really versatile, spacious, everyday bag. This can come in the form of a sling or of a really good backpack, enough that it can carry all of your everyday essentials when you go sightseeing. Now, this may vary depending on what equipment you're carrying. So if you're traveling light, I recommend having a sling that can carry all of your everyday essentials and your valuables with you so you can keep your valuables close to your body and away from any potential pickpocketers depending on where you are. Alternatively, if you're carrying a number of clothes to prepare for different weather or maybe some camera equipment, I recommend getting a spacious day pack pack that's really comfortable and has multiple quick access compartments to get the things that you need in a jiffy. Next up is getting some gear for your ears. I tried to make that flow, didn't really work. Anyway, now because you'll be in environments where you can't always control the volume or the noise of others or other things around you, having a really good pair of noise canceling headphones or earphones. Alternatively, if you don't want to invest in a pair of noise canceling headphones, consider getting yourself a set of really comfortable earplugs. This will come in clutch if you are on a long plane trip when the passenger next to you is a particularly loud snorer or you may have a restless baby on board while you're trying to get some sleep. Same may go for the accommodation that you're staying in, depending on where you're located, if you're in a busy city or there's a lot of sound around you. Making sure you are well rested is one of the best things you can do while traveling, especially given how much energy you're gonna be using up, going on adventures, exploring and checking out new things. Next up, something to read and write with. There'll often be quiet moments or lulls in your trip when you either may be resting after a day of adventure or in transit and staring at a digital screen or watching a movie isn't quite something you really feel like doing to unwind your mind. I find in these moments one of the best things to do is either read or have yourself an ebook such as a Kindle. If you're a fast reader and you get through multiple, you can hold an entire collection of books on there. Also, I have a journal. I carry it everywhere with me so I can note down, brainstorm or even just reflect on beautiful memories and capture them in the moment. That way I can look back at them and I have a written record of moments that I may have forgotten about in the future. And the last type of gadgets you need are for your heart and for your hydration. What do I mean by this? When traveling or on holiday, our routines often get thrown out of whack. So I found that having a smartwatch helps me stay on top of making sure that I'm moving enough, that I'm getting enough sleep, and I can track my general energy levels. So that way, if my vital signs show that I'm quite tired, I can back off, create space in my day, and chill out until my energy is recuperated. And often because we're so busy and out on the go, we can forget to stay hydrated. So I recommend investing in a really good quality stainless steel bottle that you can refill whenever possible. And it's worth noting that some countries you're traveling to may have unsafe tap water. So fortunately, you can also purchase yourself smart water bottles that are capable of filtering water for you. So my friend, that's our roundup of the best types of gadgets and gear you need to be bringing on your next holiday. So good luck on your next trip, safe travels, and I'll see you next time. Oh, and if you enjoy these tips, please subscribe to Flight Center for more.